Hey, good to see you there. I'm Dr. Matthew Harb. I'm an orthopedic surgeon, and today we're gonna check out some viral videos. Let's take a look. So what do we got here? This is a severe curve in the back. Anytime the curve is more than 10 degrees, we call it scoliosis. You can see this is much more than a 10 degree curve. Looks like this is a chiropractic adjustment to try and fix the curve. The thing is, when curves are this bad, you know, in foreign countries, this may be the best treatment, but here in the United States, we'll either put you in a brace, or if it's more than 40 degrees, we'll sometimes even do surgery to actually correct the spine and do what's called a spinal fusion. All right, what do we got? You got it. So this, yeah. a lot of people mistake this for a prosthesis, but it's not a prosthesis. This is actually someone who had an acute burn to their finger, meaning it could have been chemical, it could have just been really hot water, but the skin around the actual right. bone has completely flared up and created this massive blister. This is a medical emergency. You need to go to the emergency room, need to get to the hospital, have to drain this. Hopefully you won't lose your finger. I think in this case, they needed to perform what's called an amputation and take the finger off. And that was to prevent a severe infection or what we call sepsis. So you have to do that to prevent the patient from dying. Let's take a look at moving some muscle and skin. Nice. So this is over the heel. This is a very common place to have severe injuries where you can't cover them. This is called a free flap, so the skin and muscles actually rotated over, and you can see that little scar there. That's where they hooked up the blood vessels. We do this when you have a, a large bony defect or areas that you can't close with just a simple skin graft. So this is usually for a pretty serious injury. What do we got? Uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> so this okay. is a person who has dislocated their shoulder, meaning the shoulder is no longer in the correct position. Good shit. There's a couple Good different shit. techniques we can do to do this and uh, to put it back Good in place. And right now he's reduced it, which is great. He feels a lot better because that shoulder is not slipping all over the place. The muscles and ligaments and tendons that are torn are back in the right position. And so we call this a closed reduction of the shoulder. If for some reason you can't get it back in in the emergency room, we would go to the operating room and probably do a surgical stabilization as well. So this is a button hook. This is a great device if you have neuromuscular disorders like Parkinson's or your hands or muscles just don't work very well. It can really help to get on a shirt and get you dressed. Thanks for watching. If you guys enjoyed these videos, make sure to hit the subscribe button and hope you have a great day.